We're recording. Hi, I'm John. And I'm Paul from Recording Magazine. Welcome to our latest video review. Today we're going to be looking at Focusrite's Claret Plus Octopri, which we also reviewed in the October 2022 issue of Recording Magazine. In our December 2021 issue, we looked at the updated Focusrite Claret Plus 8 Pre, which boasts quite a few sonic improvements over the first generation Claret 8 Pre, which was released back in 2015. The entire Focusrite Claret range has received this new Plus designation, featuring similar upgrades across the entire line. This includes the Claret Plus Octo Pre, an 8 channel microphone preamp with onboard digital conversion and ADAT optical connectivity. The Claret Plus Octopri and the Claret Plus Apri are strikingly similar in appearance. The two units share the same solidly built chassis, layout, and controls. The LED screen is clear and bright, the buttons feel nice and solid, and the knobs are very smooth and balanced with great resistance. All that to say, the Claret Plus Octopri is solidly built and should stand up to many years of use. In addition, the front panel features a clean and very straightforward layout. Two XLR quarter-inch combo jacks reside on the left side of the unit, and this is followed by a pair of 48-volt switches that engage phantom power on channels 1 through 4 and 5 through 8, respectively. Because phantom power is shared in groups of four, you're going to want to make sure to plan your microphone inputs accordingly, especially when you're using sensitive ribbon mics or older self-powered tube mics. Another nice feature is that just like the Claret Plus 8 Pre, each channel has its own dedicated gain knob. A six-segment LED meter helps monitor the input and output levels of each of the eight channels. Next, there are four LED-equipped function buttons that engage the channel inserts, air function, or to toggle inputs one and two to high-Z instrument mode. Instrument mode should be used when connecting a guitar or bass directly into the unit. The final buttons on the right let you select the clock source, the sample rate, and an ADAT to line output switch. The rear panel is packed with I.O. options. There are six combo inputs, eight TRS insert jacks, BNC word clock, and two pairs of ADAT optical ins and outs. The line outputs are handled by a DB25 connector. The line outs can be set to the analog outputs of the eight preamp channels, or when the ADAT to line switch is engaged, the Claret Plus Octo Pre becomes an interface expansion box, feeding the ADAT optical inputs to the line outputs. Each of the microphone and line inputs has been redesigned, offering 57 dB of gain and 118 dB of dynamic range. Inputs 1 and 2 make use of a high-impedance JFET circuit designed for clean, clear, direct guitar and bass tones. What does this mean in the real world? It means that the Claret Plus Octopri offers massive amounts of headroom and low noise, which results in a more faithful representation of your microphone or of the source. As you saw around the back, each of the eight channels has its own insert point. Often, you might get insert points on the first channel or two, but rarely on all eight in a multi-channel preamp in this price range. This is handy if you want to further shape your sound with an outboard EQ or compressor while tracking. You can also use the Octopri inserts as a separate set of direct outputs. Connecting the Claret Plus Octopri and the Claret Plus 8 Pre was a breeze. It's as easy as connecting a pair of ADAT cables to the corresponding in and out of each unit, and then choosing the appropriate clock source. While the Octopri works seamlessly with the 8 Pre, it will also work with any ADAT equipped interface, making the Claret Plus Octopri a wonderful expansion option in any ADAT equipped setup. One of my favorite features of the Claret Plus Octopri is the air circuitry. The Focusrite Air function employs analog circuitry to reproduce the sonic signature of the classic Focusrite ISA 110 preamp. Engaging the air controls changes the input impedance to the same load as the original ISA 110. It also adds two cumulative high frequency shells for a 4 dB boost in the extreme high frequencies. It's a subtle yet noticeable effect that adds openness and, well, quite honestly, air to the sound. It's great for adding depth and sparkle to drum mics, it can help an acoustic guitar come alive harmonically, and even add some breath to a vocal take. It really helps bring your parts forward in a mix. 
One thing to be aware of is that unlike many microphone preamps, for instance, Focusrite's ISA 828 Mark II, there are no controls for polarity or a high pass filter. However, you can easily perform these functions in your DAW after the fact. And speaking of DAWs and software, the Claret Plus Octopre comes with the Hitmaker Expansion Bundle, which is free to download once you register the unit. This software package includes plugins, software, and more, including Antares AutoTune Access, Relab LX480 Essentials, SoftTube Marshall Silver Jubilee 2555, XLN Audio Addictive Keys and Addictive Drums 2, and of special note, you also get Brainworks BX Council Focusrite SC, a software recreation of the famed Focusrite ISA mixing desk, and you also get the Focusrite Red plugin suite. For your DAW needs, you get a three month subscription to Avid Pro Tools Artist and access to Ableton Live Lite. Finally, you get access to Lander Studio with five free masters. Of course, a preamp is only as good as it sounds. And to check out what the Claret Plus Octopre is capable of, we enlisted the help of some of our friends to come over and play through a little funk tune that John put together just for this occasion. To really show off the benefit of the added inputs alongside a Claret Plus 8 Pre, I did go a bit crazy with the drum mics. We used air on the drums in the horns, and other than that, no additional EQ or processing has been applied. <laughs> I really hope you enjoyed this little look and listen to the Claret Plus Octopri and the Claret Plus Apri. The Claret Plus Octopri streets at around $799, which is roughly $100 per channel for each of the eight high quality low noise preamps. When you consider that you also get outstanding A to D, D to A conversion, JFET high impedance inputs, the air circuits and the Hitmaker expansion bundle, what's not to love? If you'd like more information on the Claret Plus line, be sure to check out Focusrite.com. You can also check out my review of the Claret Plus Octopri in the October 2022 issue of Recording Magazine, as well as the Claret Plus 8 Pre in the December 2021 issue. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to give us the old thumbs up below, and better yet, subscribe to Recording's YouTube channel for additional product reviews, video comparisons, how-to videos, and more. Then stop by recordingmag.com for the best in all things recording, where you can subscribe to our print publication, which is now in its 36th year. We'll see you soon. Thanks, John. You're welcome.